Hello to all my randoms out there. This is Amanda. This is my channel, Amanda Random, and I got a Dollar Tree for you. Stay tuned if you want to see all the great things that I got this time at the Dollar Tree. All right, guys, these were new. I've seen different um, colors of these before put out, but I've never seen um, the notebook and pen with the little notes and the pen that comes right here in these particular styles. So um, I definitely thought by the Jot brand, I think it says there's 80 sheets in here. And it is the cute little notebook with the pen right there on the side. And I just thought, that is so cute. I absolutely need that to throw into my um, friend mail pile. And uh, I had to pick this up just because I'm loving the butterflies and the flowers on the front of this. So for a new product, I thought these were absolutely adorable. All right, guys, you've seen these in my last um, haul, but I had to show you again um, because I'm in love with these, so I did pick up a couple more. This is a notebook with 96, 96 colored sheets in there, and you can see it's orange, yellow, blue, and green, and they are lined paper. I do have one right over here to kind of show you um, what they look like inside. And these are just, they're amazing notebooks for a buck. So I did pick up another one of those for friend mail as well. Um, I'm just loving those. Those are like the coolest. So I was so happy to pick up some more. Um, I did pick this little ball up. It is the emoji and it's just the little kissy face girl um, emoji ball. They do have them in a bunch of different colors or um, different faces and emojis. So this is the one I picked up because I thought she would look cute. Possibly just sitting up here watching me for now. So that was a new product that I found. Um, this this isn't really necessarily a new item, but it is a by the Jot brand, and it's a carabiner and a retractable pen. And I did pick it, pick it up. I cannot talk again today. I did pick it up in red, and it is just um, a 1.0 millimeter medium black ink. And the reason I picked this up is because I want to be able to hook this into... Um, a spot in my van because I'm always losing pens and I just thought okay this is gonna work really good so I'm gonna pick one of these up and throw it in the van <laughs> all right guys this is also um, something they were just putting out I know they've had them before but my kids love these I know it's too warm out right now but I picked one up just to throw in the cupboard um, they love the Swiss Miss Marshmallow Hot Cocoa, so there's six envelopes in here, and I just thought, for a dollar, I'm definitely picking this up for the kids just to put into the cupboard for one of those nights where they might decide um, that they want that hot cocoa. All right, guys, we also found the traditional Chex Mix. Um, the snack mix, and it's the traditional. There are, let's see, I think it's 8.75 ounces in this bag. So to find these at the Dollar Tree for a buck is a great, great snack to have on hand. Um, so I did pick up one of those and another one of those. Um, and then this was something new that my husband wanted to try, and these are bugles, but they're the hot buffalo, um, bursting with bold buffalo. So, I don't know, we'll see. He wanted to try those, so I picked those up for him, and I've seen these once before, but I've never picked them up for some reason at my Dollar Tree, but this is by Arizona, the combo tray, and it's nachos and cheese dip. Um, I don't know. It says you can micro peel off cover, place in microwave for approximately 30 seconds. So, I don't know. It looked kind of, kind of intriguing. So, my kids love nachos. So, I did pick up two of these. And I just thought, how handy is that? That it comes in its own little tray and it's pick it up, eat it, warm it up, do whatever you got to do with it. And bam, into the garbage. Anything that causes less of a mess for this mom is a great buy in my book.
Zoe has claimed our Dollar Tree bags down there. And speaking of Zoe at the Dollar Tree, um, I did find Nine Lives Daily Essentials. And it's just this cute little pack of food, and it is, let's see, 12 ounces in here. So I did pick this one up. Um, just another thing to have on hand. It does say it's, um, like I said, the Nine Lives brand is supposed to be a really good brand of cat food. So I also found then the Caring for Cats Nine Lives, and these are the Soft Treats. And this one is Ocean Melody flavor. So... I'm thinking, Zozo, where'd you go, go? Okay, she disappeared. I'm thinking she might really like those. So if you do see the Nine Lives brand, it's probably definitely a good thing if you grab that for a dollar because you're not going to find it for a dollar anywhere else. All right, I did find this um, sport armband case by eCircuit, and it says it works with most smartphones. Um, it does have an adjustable Velcro enclosure, um, so just, you can see that here on the back. And what you do is you just tuck your phone inside of here, and as you can see, just like in this picture, that way it can calculate if you use something like we do, um, iJazz, which is the Nike Run app and things like that. Um, so for a dollar, I figured, hey, will I not have something like this for, you know, to keep track instead of always holding it in my pocket when we go for our walks. So I did pick up one of these to try and little Miss Jasmine Jane is going crazy over here because I did find sweet some tarts. sweet tarts and they're the chewy sours. Now and back in my them. day, these weren't called sweet tart chewy sours. These were called shock tarts. So if anybody else remembers them being called shock tarts, give me a thumbs up and leave me a comment in the in the comment section below because I swear they were always called shock tarts and they were so good. So on to the next. Yay, alcohol prep pads. Um I did pick these up prior um I think I got like three boxes in one of my last hauls. I did pick them up again because they are just perfect. They're the perfect size, the perfect everything for me to carry them around with me um, in my diabetes bag because I am diabetic and every time I have to take a shot, um, you always want to make sure you use one of these to sterilize the area that you're going to um, put the shot in your belly into. So... Um, this brand for a dollar each is a really good buy, so I did pick up three more of the Curad Alcohol Prep Pads. Okay, you guys, you cannot tell me you're not excited about this. This made me so happy. Um, I did find the Layer It Lip Smackers, and this one is Layer Your Flavors Strawberry and Vanilla Swirl. So it shows you inside there, that's the color, and then down here, you get to layer it with, I'm assuming this is the vanilla, or the vanilla swirl, and the, the insides maybe strawberry. Not quite sure, but I picked up every one that I could find. This one is berry cream cake. Ooh, so that's going to be kind of cool. And this one by Lip Smackers is Raspberry Orange Sherbet. So this one, oh yes, I am definitely, definitely um, cannot wait to try these. And Jasmine already wanted to pick out which one she wants to keep for her own little purse. So if you find the Lip Smackers, go ahead and pick them up. Um, definitely worth the buck. Alright guys, I have seen a lot of different people haul these special addic special edition um, uh, pens. I never had, but I did just see them all put out. Um, and it's super smooth advanced ink, so I figured, you know what, I will pick them up and I will give them a try. This one right here is the black ink, and this one here is in the blue. So... You do get two in there, so for the buck, I don't know, we'll see if they work decent, but I figured everybody else was liking them, so I definitely wanted to give them a try, too, for as much as I use pens. So, 
definitely picked those up and I'm hoping they work really good. Last but not least, I found some awesome new coloring books. Um, this one is kind of just like the normal ones, but it is mandalas and it's an adult coloring book. Um, so I picked this one up because I love the mandalas and it's just, those are fun and easy for me to color. And I just loved some of the designs in this book. So look at the little owl. So I did pick this one up, but the one that I was excited the most about finding are these two, actually, and this one is easy to use full color number keys, and this is just color by number for advanced coloring. And then it shows you down here which color you're supposed to use, and when you flip open to one of these pages, it gives you your color codes down here. And then each of these has its own particular color that matches to the code. And you get to sit. I mean, how kind of stress relieving is that if you want to take your mind off something? You find your light blue color. And now we go and find all of the number ones and color those the light blue. And then we got this light purple. So you find all of the number two. Sorry about that, guys. I must have lost you somewhere here on my wonderful camera. Um, but anyway, like I was saying, you just match the numbers and you get, you end up with these really pretty, um, different designs. And I'm wondering if it shows you in the back. I believe it does. And here is what some of them end up to look like when you color the pixel or, you know, the number by the number. So I just thought that is so cool and so different something you know new and like I said not all of them are triangles these are little um circles and these are what you'll end up with if you follow the color codes correctly so for a buck I was like extremely happy to find this book and the next new one that I found was the Extreme Dot to Dot Original Hand Drawn Puzzles to Complete and Color. Now, this is no joke. Like, when you look in here, look at how little some of these are. And tell me, you have to pay attention here to figure out what you got going on. So, depending upon what kind of mood you're in, it might be something that you want to just sit down and do. I mean... It looks fun. It looks a little intimidating, actually, but um, just to take you out of the realm, if you don't want to just color and you kind of want to put, you know, more into it, here is an answer key in the back. It does show you what each one ends up being when you finish the dot to dot, but I love the concept of what they did here. They did the dot to dot and added some, like, um, watercolor or something, so that could be fun thing to do, too. Just that look of the dot to dot is definitely something cool um so that is all i have for this dollar tree haul you guys but um oh i lied i lied i got one of these here pink boxes for jazzy for school and it just opens up um she is going into second grade and last year i made a mistake of not picking one of these up right away and i could not find the cool pink one that she wanted to have um pinkish purple i guess so now, I swear, I am done with this Dollar Tree haul. <laughs> so, thank you all for watching. Keep an eye out for all of these new products. And, as always, stay random. And I will be back again soon. Much love to you all. Bye, guys.